Hello everyone, this is lesson 1 in the series regarding Wix toolset. In this series, we will go through how to create a cool MSI Windows installer setups using Wix toolset. I hope this will be a knowledgeable and enjoyable series. So without wasting any time, let's start. First thing to know, what does Wix stands for? So Wix stands for Windows Installer XML. From the name itself, you might have guessed on which language it is based on. So it is based on a declarative XML. Wix uses a set of tools in order to create a Wix installer. We will discuss about these tools in our next slide. So with the help of Wix, we can create the number of files which are listed here. The first one is installer whose extension is .msi. The second one is patches whose extension is .msp. Third one is merge modules whose extension is .msm. And the fourth one is transforms whose extension is .mst. Regarding the license of the Wix, it is an open source and it is being managed by .NET Foundation. We will get to know more about Wix in our next slide. So in order to create a project of Wix, we need a Visual Studio. In the Wix website, you can find a plugin for Wix which can be used as an extension in Visual Studio in order to create Wix projects. These Wix projects can be built and we can generate a .msi or msp, the respective outputs from these projects. In the right hand side, you can see the set of tools that are being used by the Wix in order to generate a Windows installer. The name of the tools are like candle, light, dark, heat, melt, dot, smoke and pyro. These tools are helpful in order to create a Wix installer. Each one of them is having its own importance and is being used in the different scenarios in the generation of Wix installer. In order to create a MSI which is an installer, we majorly need a candle and a light tools. We will get to know more about these tools whenever we start creating our Wix projects. Let us go to our next slide where we will depict the each and every step while uh, generating a Wix installer. So this is a basic diagram for the Wix toolset interaction. In this diagram, it is depicting each and every steps in the generation of Wix installer. As you can see here, the .wxs is the starting point for a Wix installer. So it is a source file. This source file is given to a candle tool. This candle tool uses this wxs and generates .wix obj, which is an intermediate file. Again, this .wxx obj is sent to light. And this light generates a binary output, which is nothing but an installer uh, of different extensions like MSI, MSI, MSP or MSM. So these are the basics that are required in order to start with Wix toolset. In the next videos, we will see how to install a Wix toolset and how to start with creating Wix projects using this toolset with the help of Visual Studio. That's it from this video. Thank you.